Hey, I'm Carl with Apt, and we're here today to show you how to set up the Circle with Disney device. And this is a device that's designed to aid in uh, controlling the internet usage in your house. So, first things first, we've got an iOS device here. I've got an iPad mini, and we are going to download the Circle application, and the app button will look like this. It says Circle. Click on that, and our opening screen is going to come up here, and it's going to have these two little rotating arrows down at the bottom, and that's going to indicate that it is working. So those take a few seconds here. We'll let those run. And now it's ready to go. You're going to see a little video playing in the background here, and there is a begin button at the bottom. So we click on that. And here's our welcome screen. And we're going to have to click continue. And it's checking for updates. No updates available for this one right now. And we've already got our circle plugged in, so we're already ready to hit continue here. And then we're going to connect the circle to a to form a hotspot. So on the iOS device here, we can hit the home button and go to settings. And then under Wi-Fi, there's going to be an option here that says it's not always going to say circle 1931, but it'll start with circle. So we click on that, and the password is my circle. C L E, and then click on join. And that's going to link us up to the Circle network that is uh, being sent out by the Circle device. So from here, we've got the little check mark, so we know that we're logged onto the Circle network. We'll double click our home button here and go back to the Circle app. And here it's going to allow us to hit continue. So now we're going to pair the Circle to our home Wi Fi. So we'll click on continue, and it's going to search through and find the Wi Fi networks that are available. Um, our home Wi-Fi network here is Netgear 38, so we'll click on that one, and then we enter the home Wi-Fi password. And once we've entered the password, we're going to click on Done, and it's going to connect that circle to the home Wi-Fi network. So it'll take a few moments here while it searches and gets connected. And we're almost done. So. From here, we have to go back into our settings and go back to our home network. So we'll double click here because we've left this open. Go back into settings, into Wi-Fi, and we're going to click back on Netgear 38, which is the home network. And again, double click the home button, back to the circle application, and now our circle is paired to our home network. So from here, we'll click on continue, and now we have to set up an account. So. We'll go to name, and we'll type in store name. And then for email, we'll type in our email address here. And click on done. And then once you do that, you can click continue, and it'll bring you to the next page. Now here, you have to enter a phone number because they're going to text you a code to get into the Circle application. So you have to put in a phone number here that you can receive text messages on. And once you've done that, click continue. And you'll wait for a moment. And if we watch here on the phone, we've got a text message. So our circle passcode is 7636 for this particular one. That'll be kind of unique to whichever, your, uh, whichever text message you get. So then once you have that, we'll enter that in, 7636. And now that's verified. Now we are getting closer. Click on continue here, and now we're going to add a profile. So we'll add, we'll just call this one the store name here, apt. So you can enter your name or whoever's going to be in charge of controlling the circle device. You can also add a photo so people know who that is. We're not going to do the photo right now, we'll just put the name in. Click on next, and then they're going to give you different options here, and it'll give you a little description about what uh, what's allowed and what's not allowed on each one. So for the, for the person that's going to be setting this up and controlling everything, probably set it to none so that everything's open to you. And then click on Save. OK, and then it's going to let you decide if you want to turn this off for bedtime. So that's going to allow you to set a time for the internet to shut down um, on everyone's devices that you choose. You can toggle that on and off right here. We're going to skip that for now. And now we're on to assigning devices. So we've got a number of different devices in the house here. So we're going to choose which devices belong to the person who's setting it up. It, it'll give you all these little step-by-step -step instructions right here. So we'll click on the little X down in the corner there. And I want to control, uh, let's see here, 
Samsung device. This one belongs to me. And let's see, we've also got a Apple device. And that one belongs to me as well. And then we'll click on Done. So now those are the devices uh, that belong to me that are going to be in that category of, of no restriction. So then if we want to, we can add another, uh, another family member on here. We're, right now we're just going to go, I'm finished. And we've got unmanaged devices that are on this network. So we'll click on Continue and click on OK. And that's going to select all the smart devices that you have in the home. And we'll click on Done and then continue. So now the home filter, you can select any of these. If you have a lot of kids in the house, um, you can select kid. And then once you do that, it'll, it'll have preset things clicked off and on for you. So you can run through if you want to sort of customize it, turn different things on and off, you can do that. Um, adult is going to have most everything turned on. And then you also have a no restriction. So nothing's going to be filtered. Um, so we'll do, let's do teen for right now and click on done. And that's all set. So click on done and you are ready to go. So that's how you do the initial setup of the circle with Disney. If you have one of these, we'd love to hear your comments and uh, we appreciate you watching the videos as always. And please remember to like and subscribe on YouTube.